Iranian state television has shown footage of a missile training exercise conducted by the country's Revolutionary Guards. A spokesman said the war games tested long, medium and short range missile capability on ground and sea targets. Iran says it has a wide range of missiles and some capable of striking Israel and U.S. bases in the region. Well, Iran has also unveiled the next stage of its space program, and it says it's going to send a monkey to the stars next month. It may sound strange, but it's giving the West some cause for concern over the country's missile arsenal. And it's not the first time that animals, in fact, have been put into space. In 1948, NASA began putting monkeys in their rockets. Most of them died and are still considered the unsung heroes of the space race. Meanwhile, in 1951, Russia at the time began sending dogs into space and they were some of the first animals to survive space flight, but many uh, never made it home. And all these animals paved the way for the first human flight. On April 12, 1961, the Russian cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin, he became the first man in space. And last year, Iran also launched a turtle, a mouse and some worms as well. Well, Farouk Abaz is director of space research at Boston University, and he says that this mission showcases Iran's homegrown space industry. This is now all homemade. However, many of the Iranians have been studying abroad the, the way the Indians and the Chinese did. The Indians and the Chinese had people working with the, uh, in the laboratories of the United States and of Germany, of England, of France, of European, all over the place. And... Most of these people would work very hard and get the best degrees and publish papers and so on. And as soon as they are ready, they go home and they are treated as heroes and they're giving the facilities and the funds to start research uh, efforts. And they produce that. And they, the Chinese have already sent two mi manned missions into space. The Indians are working on one and the Chinese are certainly working on sending humans to the moon, including a Chinese woman, which would be something.